Hey MTV, welcome to my crib. Welcome to my freshman year dorm room tour. Hi guys, it's Sammy. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. Yes, I'm filming the intro on a different day. I decided to make this dorm room tour because I did not do one last semester and like I wanted A for the mems and B because like dorm room tours are just kind of popular because like a lot of kids just want to know what different dorms look like. Ours is like super cute and we love it, but it's not like necessarily like aesthetically pleasing. So if you're looking for that wrong video, but it's super cute, we love it. And I'm really excited to share what it looks like with you guys. Also, I make a ton of college related content so if you're interested in any of that make sure you subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos but without further ado let's get into this video all right so this is like right when you walk in just like you saw the door is like right behind you so this area is what you would call our living room, study room, hangout room, anything but sleeping probably. It's very nice because if you saw our last room, which if you've seen in my previous videos, like college videos, I'll have them linked down below and probably show a clip of our old room. It was like so small that you could literally go like this and basically touch both walls. But now we have to like walk around. I have to like walk like to my bed to get to it, not just like take a step and jump. That's why I wanted to do a tour of this room is because there's actually like space and not just like a room. I don't know, it's actually spacious and big because we're in a four person room. However, we just have three people. It just worked out that way because we have a lot of open rooms because of COVID. So we were able to move into a three or a four person room with only three people. I'll just do a quick pan of this room. So that's two desks over there and then two more of our desks over here also quick disclaimer it's not like perfectly clean it will never be perfectly clean because there's three girls living in here and we're all in different schedules we did not clean it for this video i tried to clean it a little bit actually so this isn't clean actually if i'm being honest okay so right there is olivia's desk which i don't think she's been in a actually no she was in my last move-in video and then that's my desk which i'll go into more in a second and then we have Sorry, Millie, I just keep putting you awkwardly in the background. <laughs> we have a TV in this room, which we're so excited about. We haven't used it a ton, but we watch like, we watch the Super Bowl on it. <laughs> we also watch like YouTube and Netflix sometimes. So it's definitely really nice to have space for it. It's just on our um, fourth desk. But if you have room for a TV, definitely would recommend it. And then buying like a Roku or a Prime Stick, which is what I have. And then obviously right there is Molly's desk, cause you can see Molly. We are literally both planted at our desks all the time unless we have a class. It's bad how much we are just at our desks working. Like, I feel like there's always work to do and we can just never get it done. Like, Molly is currently working on math. And I have a rocking chair. Oh, yeah. We, we also have rocking chairs, which is new this semester. Like, every suck. room. <laughs> it's, like, weird, but it's also kind of fun to rock. I don't know. And then over here, my desk. Kind of just, like, a random collage of decorations. Probably could have set that up a lot better. I have a blanket on my rocking chair because I swear I'm always freezing in this room for like the majority of the time when we're in classes. I'm literally on Zoom like bundled up with blankets around me and they're probably like what the f because I'm the only person that like has a blanket on me in Zoom but like it's cold so you gotta do what you gotta do. So looking more at my desk, I normally don't have like obviously my ring light and stuff on it. I have my really nice mirror that I got for my birthday, which I would highly recommend like asking for one or buying one. I mean, not that you have to get like a super nice one, but definitely put a mirror on your desk because it's just really nice to like sit down and get ready or do your makeup or whatever. And especially if you like share a room, you typically only have like one mirror. So you like all don't want to like be trying to use it at the same time. So definitely get a mirror. I showed this in my Amazon haul. It's a laptop stand, but it's really nice because I always just put like my zoom up here and then I take notes like down here on my iPad, so I'd highly recommend getting one of those. But yeah, nothing really interesting on my desk. Just thought I would share those few things. Another thing is I keep all my jewelry in this like, I don't even know what to call it, like cyl cylinder glass thing. Honestly, there's definitely better ways to keep your jewelry. Wouldn't really recommend that. I keep all my masks and keys and student ID all on those two command strips, so I just know where they are at all times. Very convenient. This is like the living part of our living room. We have a huge love sack, which is literally it's so comfortable. We sit in it all the time and just do work. Um, or if we're just chilling or if we have friends, they all sit in this huge love sack. Super comfortable. And this is our guest bed. We're not supposed to have guests, so it's actually not a guest bed. But so sorry if you see that. All right, it's what happens. Yeah, just like our friends that go to different schools that they want to come see us. 
extra bed because it's a four person room. Okay, and then walking over this direction, our kitchen slash bathroom area. It was actually really funny because last week, or yeah, like last week or something, I posted a TikTok of making coffee and someone had commented and were like, why are you making coffee in your bathroom? And it's like, cause it's the same thing as my kitchen. This is just like super basic, obviously. We actually have a lot of fridges as you can see. <laughs> it's pretty nice cause our mirrors have like storage in them. So we put like a ton of stuff in there. There's nothing like super special about it. It just kind of looks like this majority of the time when it's clean or whatever, but the mirror can also get very dirty with as many girls as we have, obviously. And then over here we have our fridges. This is Molly's fridge. I mean, we share all of them, but like Molly's fridge and then Molly brought um, the microwave as well. And then down there is my fridge and we have a dish rack at the top too which i would highly recommend kind of something you don't really think about necessarily but when you're doing dishes you don't want to like make your towels soaking wet so just get a dish rack so then they can dry on their own definitely <laughs> then we just have like a random storage rack down there and then we just store a lot of like dishes and our blender that we aren't supposed to have. I'm really out here exposing us in this video. <laughs> so if any of the RAs see this, like we're probably like <laughs> gonna be fined a lot. Oh, blender and toaster. Blender, oh yeah, and we have a toaster. But I'm like, if they see us, then it's like, just don't say anything. There's no point. Are you really that bored? You gotta like, come find us. Roasting the RAs in your YouTube videos. Yeah, like I like, most of them are cool. Yeah. Anywho, but like, yeah, just don't get mad at us. Okay, and then there's our bathroom door. But yeah, the full body mirror is obviously nice just so we can see what we look like, obviously. And then I'll show you the bathroom very briefly, nothing special. <laughs> it's really nice because we have just a bathroom in our room, which all of the um, rooms in our dorm hall have bathrooms in their rooms, so yeah. We have this toilet rack that just like, we put random stuff on, like toilet paper and whatnot. There's our nice toilet. And then, a ton of towels because again a ton of girls that's where we put all of our like bathroom or shower stuff because again we have a ton of girls so we have like a ton of products so we need like a lot of room the shower is pretty dang small i don't know if you can tell in the video but there's not a lot of like storage space so i definitely recommend like bringing like a, ra a rack like that or something to store your things in and we also have this nice shower head that live added to our room because it makes our shower is so much more enjoyable and it switches like to jet to shower to whatever you want so it's definitely really nice i definitely recommend um getting one of those if you have like a shitty shower head back out of the bathroom we have molly and i's very chaotic cart yeah and we just put like all of our dishes and whatnot in it just a bunch of random stuff pretty much there's such limited storage and there's not very many options to do things i feel like everybody does the same thing anyways then we're back right by our guest bed and <laughs> love sack. Um, that is one of Liv's like storage things. I don't really know what's in there. Our neighbor lives Oh my gosh, we have the loudest neighbors ever. Also in our living room, we have our two closets because we get four closets since it's a four person room. And those are two of the closets right there, just like right beside all of the desks and stuff. And we put curtains over it just to kind of cover up the chaotic mess behind all of them. <laughs> that's Molly's right there. And then that's like all of our snack and food stuff. I'll show you some of our snack drawers because they're pretty cool. <laughs> Here is like chips and stuff. <laughs> we have a lot, I'll admit. And then down here we have, I don't even know. That's just like a random assortment. Sweets and breakfast. Yeah, sweets and breakfast and protein shakes. <laughs> And now let's go into our bedroom. In the living area, the doorway to the bedroom's right there, and there's a curtain hanging up. This curtain is for like if some, well we shut it every time we sleep, but it's for if like somebody's sleeping during the day and like the other people are out there with the light on, it keeps the room super dark or like as dark as it can be. That's really nice, something we didn't have in our previous dorm last semester, so. Would also recommend that if you have the opportunity to do something like that. Okay, this is the bedroom area. This is Molly's bed right here. Um, as you can tell by the big M. And my bed is that bed over there. We both have some fairy lights put up behind there. And then this is Olivia's bed. She just went somewhere, so I'm kind of exposing her right now. It's kind of... <laughs> It's a little bit messy, but I promise you she literally makes her bed more than me and Molly do. So, not trying to expose her too much. She doesn't really make it. She just got ready and went somewhere. <laughs> Under all of our beds, we have a ton of storage. So that's what my storage looks like. I have like a ton of laundry to do right now. Kind of bad. 
and then I just keep that it has a bunch of random stuff in it and then that has like just a bunch of clothes because it's the dresser that they supply us with and just to kind of like see all of our beds there's Olivia's there's Molly's and there's mine yeah there's nothing too much more about this room except for like our closets that's mine and that's Liv's I'll show you part of my closet but it's like stuffed so also I hope you can hear me okay in this room but like that thing is so loud so if you hear anything I'm sorry like it's just that like I literally cannot do anything about it it's really annoying here's what the inside of my closet looks like just a ton of sweatshirts and shirts I have a storage bin down here for shoes and then just like more storage bins up there with like random stuff but yeah that's just what it looks like yeah there's nothing really else about our bedroom okay guys that's the end of my dorm room tour i hope it all like made sense like you can picture the room once again i would love it so much if you subscribe to my channel make sure you check out my other college related content make sure to give this video a like if you enjoyed thank you so so much for watching and i'll see you all in my next video bye